today it's all about freestyle football and we've got the amazing Ollie Hayes with us. So let's see a bit of my skills and maybe some of Ollie's. Okay, you zoomed out, Adam. Don't zoom out, mate. You made me look stupid. How did you get into freestyle football? I got into freestyles after seeing a few commercials on TV like the Nike commercials, yeah. Adidas commercials and I just thought how do they do their tricks? Like is it edited or is it possible? So it looked pretty unbelievable to you to start with? Yeah of course like even for like random people to see freestyle yeah, yeah. they're like what is that? They don't know it's freestyle yet because it's not such a big sport. Yeah. So people like David Beckham and all the big football names, they can't even do the stuff you're doing, probably. Well, they, they're obviously amazing footballers, yeah. but some of them can do a few tricks, but like freestyle's totally different. It's like most freestylers are very like at a higher level of yeah. kick-ups, control, yeah. all sorts. Yeah, I did the Match of the Day magazine commercial that was like out in 2008 and that was a great experience. So who was there on that one? That was just me, the whole advert was basically focused So you did the whole advert, all the skills? Yeah, pretty much because it's a kids magazine so oh, cool. just wanted to show that they can do it, it's possible for them. Yeah, so pretty much anyone can do it, it's a great way of keeping fit obviously. So how long does it take you to learn a basic trick normally? Tricks vary like from difficulty but um, once you get to like a high level of control, yeah. kick ups and stuff, everything else like seems to come quicker. Yeah. So you can learn one trick in a day. But now at the moment I feel like I'm at the level where I could do most tricks. So it's about doing a trick and then another trick, like a combo. inspiration to do like a combo and to kind of make up tricks do you make them up in your head or do you see other people doing them and then like put your own style into it yeah it's not always freestyle footballers that I get inspiration from it's like dancers like because yeah. I want to be like a creative freestyle not just like one who does the most difficult stuff yeah definitely. and make it entertaining for the public and not just freestylers because it's like my profession so like yeah. you're like my viewer yeah. Yeah, dance has really inspired me because there's so many crews out there that do like unique performances, choreographs and music and that's what I think is the future for football freestyle. So you want it to be more creative, sort of like get into the movement more. It's all about movement but with a football basically. Yeah, definitely. It's like you've just got to make the ball seem like it's part of your body. Yeah. It's an extension of your body. Yeah, pretty much. And then you, you're going to do it to music as well, maybe in the future. Or do you do that already? For performances, I use music, but um, it's more like sound effects. Yeah. So like trying to get kicks and turns and yeah, yeah. swooshes and yeah, stuff yeah. like that. Yeah, that's something what I'm working Sounds on at the good. moment. So you're trying to take it to a different level, yeah. a higher level. Yeah, of course. Hi guys, today we're here with Ollie Hayes, freestyle footballer. Let's find a little bit up. Let's get up. Let's see Ollie in action more. Let's take it away and see him in action more. Let's see him in action more. <laughs>
Okay, guys, let's cut the chit chat and let's see Ollie in action. Yeah. Come on. <laughs>